155, the warrior mind. I was a polarizing person in the SEAL teams. Either you really like me or you fucking hate me. I started realizing why that is. And that goes for, I'm that way with everybody. And this is why I believe in the warrior mindset. It's that person to the point where you only do it if you have to do it. That's the kind of mindset right there that I don't have. I do it because I have to do it every day. Not because the job is making me do it. That's the warrior mindset. The warrior mindset is that person that is doing things that they don't want to do every single day. What are you doing today? That's the warrior mindset. A warrior crosses a finish line and continues to run in his mind. There is no finish line. There is no finish line. There is no true accomplishment yet. A lot of times we live in this fucking accomplishment world. Like let's say I did bad water. I won the 135 mile race. I'm going to enjoy this for a while. No. No. I'm not saying don't enjoy it. What are you going to do fucking tomorrow? This day is over. A warrior realizes this accomplishment is over. It's over. And so I became a Navy SEAL. And I became this. And I became this. And I became this. Do not live in that moment. Get out of it as fast as you can because it will suck you in and that will become who you are. Just that moment. Younger generation quits. Not everybody. So I got I to gotta put that. People get their butt hurt. So not everybody. Both of this generation quits the second they get talked to. You did this wrong. You did this wrong. Or, or they get yelled at. It's so easy to, you know, to, to be great nowadays because everybody else is, most people are, are weak. This, this is a softened generation. So if you have any mental toughness, any, any ability, if you have any fraction of self-discipline, the ability to not want to do it, but still do it. People have a, a hard thing to understand. I hate to run. And, and, and what makes me so crazy, it doesn't need more, is people go, well, well, why do you run if you hate it? What are you talking about? <laughs> but if you can get through to doing things that you hate to do, on the other side is greatness. That's what people understand. By me running, I am callous in my mind. I'm not training for a race. I'm training for life. I'm training for the time when I get that two o'clock in the morning call that my mom is dead or something happens tragic in life. I don't fall apart. I'm training my mind and my body and my spirit so it's all one so I can handle what life is going to throw at me because the life I've lived, it throws a whole bunch at you. And if you're not physically and mentally prepared for that, you're just going to crumble and you're good for nobody. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy the video.